Hi, this is Frank. In this video, I show how I have permanently installed the power compensator to the F-Loop 3.0 magnetic loop antenna. As a disclaimer, I am not suggesting you do this, but I explain why and how I did it. It is my personal preference and it is not required. These modifications do void the warranty. The original suggested method is to insert the compensator, tighten it with the provided nut, and then screw the PL259 over to keep it secured. I was not comfortable with that method because I interchange loops oftenly, and I had to re-tighten the nut, the PL259, every time to keep them secured. I wanted the power compensator to be permanently installed and have more threads to secure the PL259, therefore making it easier to swap loops in and out. I have tried different methods, this one is the one I ended up with. I opened the box. As a note here, gently pull the two cables for the switch with a pair of pliers. I took out one of the SO239 connectors and used it as a template. Use a sharpie to mark the two holes on the compensator arm. Then drill the arm, which is aluminum, so it was quite easy. Ensure it fits and is aligned properly. Then I inserted the compensator arm in between the SO239 and the box. Screw it back in place and notice that the screws were just long enough to accomplish this modification. I reconnected the switch, closed the box and voila! Now, when screwing the PL259, I have plenty of threads and don't have to worry about the compensator becoming loose over time as I swap loops in and out. As stated earlier, you don't have to do this. It is my preference for my needs and I assume the consequences. I share this video in case it may help someone somewhere and may also work for the F-Loop 2.0. As usual, if you like the video, click the like button. This is Frank signing out and thanks for watching 73.